Good morning. This is a video of my trip en route to China. So I forgot to record me coming to Boston, but my flight to China is from Boston. So I had to come to Boston last night and I got here early this morning. And as you can tell, I took some naps. I don't know if you can still see my sleep work, but I did. I'm gonna stop my hair, guys. Woo! So I'm gonna be rocking the all natural in China. So I will probably be getting so many looks, even more. Probably still gonna get looks cause just because I'm black, but. Here we go, here's a day in my life in Boston and then my journey to China. <laughs> hey Siri, how many stars are there? wondering why the hell didn't I apply to Harvard like actually why didn't I I like I used to be so turned off by the idea of Harvard because it's just so glorified and just seems like people really look at it like it's Jesus or something so it really turning me off from applying but I'm on campus and I'm just like I think I would have did so well here like look at this Yeah, it's really beautiful, but what gets me is just the town that it's in, actually. Um, like everything, like I just went to a ramen place three minutes away from where I'm staying. And it was really good ramen, like actually a solid seven out of 10. Mm, and that's high. Harvard, I am impressed. Maybe law school 22? Law school 2022? Stayed in existence. <laughs> okay. At the airport. Mentally preparing for this 15 hour ride. Mentally preparing for people to be touching my hair. Mm -mm, nobody gonna touch my hair. Nope, not here, not having it. <laughs> guys so we have a layover in Hong Kong to Beijing and it's a six hour layover so wow I look really bummy anyway I picked up this coconut water by the way if you guys don't know Hong Kong and Beijing I didn't know this until a couple hours ago but Hong Kong and Beijing I mean Hong Kong and the rest of China were like not together until 1997 or something like that I'm a I'm a fact check this but that's crazy to me. So like Hong Kong has different, they use different money than the rest of China. It's insane, I did not know that. Do your research. Anyway, this is the coconut water brand. Hopefully you can see that, let's see. This is the coconut water brand. But I'm gonna try it on, quarter, um, on camera. I just got into coconut water. Foco is my brand. Goya, not so much. But if this is nasty, I'm actually gonna cry. <laughs> Mm. 
it's not the sweetest coconut water I've ever had. Yeah, it's not the sweetest, but like, would I buy it again? No. <laughs> you guys, it's a Gucci store because y'all know how badly I want me some Gucci bags, but not now, you know? But I love to look. Come up in here, and then this lady following us like crazy. Like, this is her, like on the tail of our butt, like this. Walk. This is her. She's like, <laughs> And then she takes out this notepad and then she's like writing and I'm just like what the freak y'all yeah. I don't know Hong Kong's not where it's at <laughs> oh. <laughs> finally made it to my hotel room boom shower I'm about to tear this junk up y'all I'm about to tear this place up. You know why? Because, ooh, they got little cute combs. Oh, but that's not gonna do it for my kinky hair, so it's not gonna do it. It has been quite the day. We've been traveling for about a little over 24 hours. And so you already know, as a female, I need to shower, I need to get my life. But this is the hotel room. And I look crusty dusty. I actually want to burn my clothes. This is a cute little nice simple hotel room. AC up there is all I care about. No, I'm kidding. It's all I care about. I'm going to get my life and I'm going to be back. And we're going to go to dinner. Okay, you guys. Besides the fact that I look like a hot mess, I recorded without telling you guys what we're actually doing. What? So... Basically, this is called Hot Pot. You guys feel free to talk. <laughs> <laughs> just looking. It's called Hot Pot. And you just throw whatever you want in there. That's the spicy side, non-spicy side. And we've just been eating for the past hour, honestly. I'm gonna need one of these my future medicines because I'm calling eat as you go. <laughs> Ting! Y'all don't understand how important it is to take care of your skin when you get off a long flight. Like, honestly. And also, pff, you guys, I have like no ankles. Like my feet are ridiculously swollen. You see this? You see that? Ugh, sorry about my ashy feet, but like, oh, y'all see all my business out there. But yeah, this happens to me all the time when I get off a long flight because of the air pressure in the plane and i don't walk around that much during the flight so it doesn't allow blood and blood circulation to go on so my feet just swell but about three days it should all be going down and i try to walk more often but you know what? i'm gonna take care of this hair girls be like length check ah so what i have going on here is i brought my cracks I've got some Aztec, Aztec healing clay in this, and I got this bottle from Whole Foods, and then I got my apple cider vinegar in this bottle, and then I just kind of mix that together, apply it to my face, and so after that's done, I'm going to go ahead and use this Burt Bees hydration mask on my face. It's so good. Um, that's all I can say. It's so, so good. Your skin really feels like hydrated after so i'm gonna go ahead and put this on for about 10 minutes and then after i'm done with that what then i'll do is no so after this i'm gonna go ahead with my witch hazel and some cotton pads wipe down whatever excess dirt i have on there then i'm gonna go ahead with the mask and then after the mask i'm gonna use this rose water and then i'm gonna finish off with my um moisturizer as you guys i've told you guys a bunch of times my moisturizer is by this girl at my church touch by glory so check it out my makeup video if you haven't already so i'm talking too much this video is too long okay bye <laughs>